Hey, it's Andrea back with another hashtag K12 PR tip. And today we're talking about crisis communication and how it relates to social media. So first of all, if your school is dealing with some type of crisis, know that direct communication is key. Social media posts do not get to everyone. You need to use your direct email or phone call. You know, those communication methods should be the first priority. Second thing to remember is that not everything belongs on social media, right? Not everybody's gonna see it anyways and Sometimes you're, you know, opening it up for the entire world to see. Do you really want everybody commenting on what's going on? Social media isn't always the right answer. And number three, if you choose to post something on social media, you need to monitor the comments closely. Help out your social media manager. Maybe you have to assign a superintendent or a principal or somebody to help monitor those comments, answer questions and be prepared for hey, maybe some um, critical uh, feedback uh, from your community or from people outside your community. We hope these three tips help in regards to crisis communication and kind of planning. I have a great blog with some additional resources that you can check out. And until our next tip, I want you to keep telling those positive stories. Our students and staff, they deserve to be celebrated out on social media. Bye-bye.